seems that your life has just been lit by fortuosity. Because as chance would have it, someone has already arranged your fare. While you wait your turn, I'll have you know that there's pure inspiration in every rotation of this 68 horse carousel. When life held the brass ring out to Ross Davis, he seized it firmly, using the opportunity to bring a bigger, better carousel to Griffith Park. Before settling in its new home, the 1926 carousel had seen its share of lovely twists, bumps, and dips along life's highway. And it's even taken on a few survivors from its sister carousel in Lincoln Park. Of late, the carousel has even learned to dance to its own tune, approximately 1,500 of them. After all is said and done, the old carousel looks pretty good for 91 years of age. Now, one does not lead such a rich life without making a few friends along the way. And a few of those friends have stepped in and dignified her, restoring some of her beauty, both inside and out. As of late, the carousel has even acquired a new electric motor, which has earned her the title as one of the fastest carousels on the West Coast. Now, all of those things are fine. But there's one thing that the carousel is especially known for, or rather, someone. Particularly two young girls whom she would entertain Sunday afternoons in the 1950s. And their father as well. You would notice the families at the park spending time together. But it was really the children that seemed to get a kick out of the carousel, while mom and dad would usually look on from some nearby carriage or bench. The carousel benches also share an exciting chapter in this story, for they continue to inspire people in three separate locations away from the carousel. They even have their own legacy. If you happen to traverse down Crystal Springs Drive again, whether you have children or not, rest on a bench, ride a horse, and gather a little inspiration 